All right, guys, just a little update, a little video, right? So, what was happening is me and um, this lad, Nick, he's one of my members in my WhatsApp group, and he's a HGV driver, class one, and he um, he's going to be a taxi driver because he only does, he was just like, I think he does like four hour shifts of an evening, Monday to Friday, and wants to do something around the shift. So, he's thinking about getting on the taxis, right? But I said to him, let's do a head to head. So, let's do Uber XL first, HGV class one. Who earns more, right? So I said to him, as you know previously with all the other head-to-head -head videos, how the videos work, I don't think Nick grasped it. But obviously it was just brilliant, and this is the reason what's happened. So I said to him, um, let's do a head-to-head, -head. send me some videos and see what happens. And he's literally sent me like eight, nine minutes worth of videos of his whole shift, right? So I said to Nick, listen, this doesn't really work as a head-to-head, -head, but... I watched them all and thought it was dead interesting. I found it fascinating, to be honest, because obviously you don't really know what the heavy goods guys go through or what they need to do and all that. And um, I just thought the video was dead interesting. Um, and obviously he shows us how much he puts in his HGV, which is shocking with the fuel prices at the moment. So I said to him, if it's okay with you, let's not do the head-to-head -head this time. It will be coming up, by the way, so make sure you subscribe to the channel because it will be coming up. See who earns more. But for this video, it is going to be the life of a HGV driver. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you give Nick a lot of love in the comments, please. And uh, definitely like and subscribe, guys, for more. Nice one. See you soon. Enjoy. Good evening here. I'm driving Nick. And uh, tonight, Marty, driver Marty, is asked uh, to go head to head with me. Um, I'm a UK based trucker and tonight I'll be driving from Stoke-on-Trent to Wigan. Uh, it shouldn't take too many hours but uh, we'll see how I do and we'll see how Matty does. I've just got laid out, this is an indirect, I'm, I'm working this evening uh, and Matty's working tomorrow morning I think. Um, yeah it's now, it's about 10 to 6, I've just arrived at the depot. Just got to go around, do some checks of the vehicle, and then uh, we should hopefully leave for the next 10 15 minutes. So uh, I'll be back soon. Okay, so this is the truck I'm driving tonight. It's a double decker trailer, 16 foot 2. She's a bit of a beast, just about fits under the bridges, I think. I think the minimum height of the bridges on the motorway is 16 foot 7, so we we just squeeze through. We just squeeze through the motorway bridges by 5 inches in this particular trailer. So, not much uh, margin for error. Anyway, I'll fasten her all up, do my daily checks, and then we'll be on our way. checks already just give you a quick look around the the truck um, it's an man bed at the back which i don't use very often with a little bunk on the top storage everywhere and uh first thing i have to do is insert insert my driver's card that she's tachograph card so they've got a record of how many hours I've driven, how fast I've gone, how many brakes I've taken and so forth but unfortunately we've been left with no diesel so the first port of call will be the uh, trucker, I don't know what they call them now well anyway the, the diesel depot <laughs> Right, so first stop, there. Right, so 
here I am at the fuel station. It's taking me about three miles off route to get here. Just fueling her up. Uh, she's going to take about. This is going to take about 14, 14, 15 minutes or so. I'll get back to you then. Let's pause the video. Right, that's it, it's all fueled up. 300 and, 310 litres. Nearly 311 litres. So, you do the maths. £1.99 a litre. And this truck you'd be lucky if it does five or six miles to the gallon so uh, uber drivers if you think you've got it bad well, these poor uh, truck haulers right all filled up now uh, ready to go the time now is 20 past six i'm 20 minutes behind schedule because of this fuel stop uh, but luckily i don't have to do it every day all right so Next stop is my last destination as well. My first and last destination will be Wigan. So uh, I'll see you there. Right, I'm here in Wigan. It's, uh, it's 20 past seven, so it's just take me an hour to get here from Stoke-on-Trent. Uh, got a bit of a part load on tonight, half empty, so this is trailer so half the top's empty normally full so it shouldn't take long to get this tipped off and then a quick reload I don't usually reload much usually 20 pallets max it's usually 50 odd pallets coming 20 odd pallets going so a quick quick reload tip and reload and then back to stoke This is the uh, warehouse facility where we get unloaded. There's usually a lot more forklift truck drivers, so looks like we're going to be a bit delayed tonight. But anyway, we're the next in line for to get tipped. Right. Woo! Right. Now we're. Uh, we're now loaded. Curtains are strapped up. You can see. Yep. We're ready to go. It's now quarter nine. So I'm, I'm a bit late. Normally, uh, normally I'm done. God. I'm usually I'm usually away from here about eight. So we're 45 minutes behind. So that petrol stop and tonight it was a bit slow in the warehouse I don't know this there was didn't see many forklift drivers so they might have some staff shortages tonight I don't know but anyway we're a bit behind so this is what it is right that's me done now I'm gonna head back to Stoke on Trent for the last part of the journey and just have to hope now we get no delays on the way back I'll, uh, I'll give you an update when I arrive there see you in a bit Right, uh, yeah, back at the yard, it's now 10 to 10, so that's taking me nearly four hours, which is, I have, me, I have to get my driver's card out, uh, that's taking me four hours, which is uh, probably an hour longer than normally, so, yeah, four hours, I've just earned 80 quid, so, but, I get paid 80 quid if I do three hours or two and a half hours, so I'll try and get it done quicker. So, that's it. Hope you enjoyed the video. Bye for now.